What's up everybody? Joe with Joe's Gold Garage here with you today. I got a new one here for you. It's been a while. Um, sorry for the delay. Uh, been kind of out of the out of the game for a little bit, but you see what I got here. I got two of them. That's right. We got the old 2010 Beater Lexus here on the scene. And we've picked up uh actually a little older es 350 uh my aunt's son my cousin he uh we found found him one at auction and he uh he bought it from uh from us and it is a jewel i tell you what it's an 07 so it's three years older than the 10 um but it is definitely in much better condition um <laughs> i mean much better condition now i don't mean to be knocking on the beater lexus it's still a good car but this uh 07 was really cared on and it shows first of all it's got a carfax that will just knock it out of the park it's got tons of service history um i believe it's about a three owner car um but tons of service history um something like 46 service records on there um just a clean clean car uh it's got these kind of aftermarket lexus uh mats on top of rubber lexus mats on top of the carpet so the carpet and everything is like in really mint shape. Uh, and as you can see, the driver's seat's in great shape. And the rest of the seats seem to be in good shape too. No tearing in this one. This one's in good, good shape. Um, that just um, goes to show if you just take a little bit of care with your uh, seat. Um, you know, they'll last. Don't have animals, pets, dogs, etc. Uh, maybe run a little, you know, rub a little conditioning ointment or some type of, you know, uh, spray or something on them and keep them soft and, and um, treated against the sun. This car also has an aftermarket tint, which is really nice. So that has probably saved on the leather uh, quite a bit as well. Um, look how clean under this engine compartment. I mean, this thing is spotless under here. I mean, just spotless. Oh man, crystal clear oil. Got that very light golden brown. But yeah, got all our covers, everything screwed into place. Everything's the way it's supposed to be. Now this is what's really special about this car. Let's crank her up. And I want you to look at something. Cause this is awesome. Check this out. <laughs> look at those miles. <laughs> 288006. Yes, we bought this at last Thursday's auction. This was a week ago. Look how clean that door panel is. Sorry to be jumping around. I'm like, ooh, look, squirrel. I mean, this thing's, the steering wheel, not cracked. Uh, got a little wear on the little pads here, but they're not nearly as gross or nasty as what I've seen in the past. Uh, got one little uh, crack in the dash. Uh, which is common with these Lexus dashes of these generations, but hey, that is not bad. Um, I think we got, got a full set of books. Like I said, Carfax was loaded with records. Um, this could probably use a little touch up. Um, you know, that's common for these to get pretty beat down. But I mean, just look at this 288,000 miles. It is a non nav car. Which that's, um, you know, that's too bad. But hey, it's not a deal killer when you find one this freaking clean. Look at this headliner. 
Look at this headliner in this back seat. I mean, this is just a lovely car. Um, I think it has, yep, it has the sunshade. It has the AC seats. Oh, yeah, I can feel it already. Um, yeah, I mean, it's just, this is awesome. Let's rev her up. <laughs> Let's take her for a drive. I will say that the new owner, my cousin, put a new set of tires on it. He said it did need a new set of tires. I didn't see the car at auction. This was all my brother's doing uh, and him just talking with me over the phone. We've got just a little bit of bumper damage where it was bumped at one point, but nothing big. Paint's nice. But yeah, new tires all the way around, so we're in good shape. Zach, you wanna go for a ride, man? My cousin's gonna ride with us. <sighs> yeah, he gonna, he gonna let us take a ride. All right. Oh. Man, I cut these cool seats on, they feel great. <laughs> yeah, on these ES350s of this vintage, the nav backup camera option was more of a 50-50 split where at about 2010 um, like my aunt's Lexus most of them came equipped with it now why that was I'm not 100% sure but it's far more common to see these uh, 07 through 09s uh, without nav and backup camera but you do still see them this one has all the other options it has the rear sunshade like I said it's got the heated and cooled seats um, golly this thing is just man this thing drops good Zach mm -hmm. <laughs> golly 288,000 I mean this is nuts there's a little bit of crack on the on yeah the yeah. But I mean, that's really, it's not that bad. Uh, I was telling the people here in the camera that I think the tinted windows, if they've been on here for a number of years, they have probably saved a lot of this interior, uh, especially the leather and just cracking of just any of it any of this wood grain can crack on these as they get older and just the heat from the south but yeah this is a nice car yeah i like these uh floor mats they, they oh i know these custom yeah the etched yeah the etched lexus mats over rubber mats on top of carpet man that's that's a, that's a way to do it right there all right we'll pick up up here at our zero to 60 spot Speed, right? No, we're wobbly. good. No, no, 70, dude. We're fine. We're, okay. all, we're no, great. These new tires fixed it. All right, guys. We're back here. Got her up to freeway speed. We, uh, my cousin just wanted to check out and see. It had a little... It had a vibration from the old tires, but he got new tires on it. And hell, I'm running 76 miles an hour, and it is smooth as glass. So we're in good shape. Good shape. So it's, like it's amazing how what a new set of tires does to a car. <laughs> it really is. I mean, it it can. Oh yeah, that is nice right there. Ah, oh, nice smooth transition. Yeah, it's amazing what it can do. Transform a car. Well, this one's a. This one's just like the rest of them. Just a little highway cruising machine right here what the whole ES 350s are known for does it wobble a little bit 
it. What well, that's break, right? you know what on the brakes we're getting just a little rotor wobble. Yeah. Um, rotors yeah. might need to be turned, but they're not awful yet. I was afraid of that. But let's get us a little acceleration pull here. Sorry, I didn't get that from first gear. That was a start from second gear, so I was a little more sluggish. But still, this thing's got the beans. Got the beans like the rest of them. So, guys, tell me what you think about the almost 300,000 mile ES350. This thing sure is a champ. And uh, it wasn't, uh, you know, if you're looking for a good used car buy, good you know car value out there in the market they're out there and these are good ones to consider um i know my cousin picked this up for i think less than five grand didn't you yeah so this was uh i mean this is a hell of a lot of car for that kind of money um so anyway drop your comment below like subscribe tell me what you think about the high mild lexus uh, it's a little nicer than the beater Lexus, ain't it? <laughs> don't, don't tell mom. Yeah. Don't tell mom. <laughs> All right, y'all have a good one. Thanks for watching. Peace. One last little footnote on the 07 ES350. When we got back here to the house, we were just, uh, we told my cousin Zach to look at the glove box and see if it came with some books. And it did. And it came with the original window sticker, which is pretty impressive. Um, I felt like this car, even though it didn't have Mark Levinson and the navigation and rear backup camera, I still felt like it had some options. Um, and so sure enough, there was a window sticker in here. Um, this car had about $6,000 in options, um, back in 07. We got the, uh, base price of 33170 uh, got the rear seat side airbags, which was an option back then for 250 bucks. The Bluetooth audio for your phone, uh, that's a $300 option. A full-size spare, 205. It does have the HID headlights with the uh, auto, um, you know, they turn in the curves, 815 bucks. Uh, I did notice the power rear sunshade, that's cool, 210. And then we have the Premium Plus package, which uh, comes, which, you know, makes these um, leather seats, the perforated leather, with the ventilation option. Uh, it also gives you rain sensing wipers, uh, the thigh extender that folds out, rolls out a little bit right there to give you a little more thigh support. It gives you the power tilt column and the power folding mirrors. Um, so that's a nice option package for $24.80. And then it had the optional $330 wood steering wheel. So uh fair amount of options on this car, uh, considering it did not come with the backup camera nav. But um, for the money, this is unbelievable uh, value and an unbelievable amount of car. I mean, it's just crazy, guys. Anyway, I wanted to get that in there for you. Peace.